Hi everyone, it's Animal649 here. Today I'm going to show you how to update the firmware on the Avamedia C281. First thing we need to do is to go onto the menu. Go to settings. Scroll all the way down till you come to product information. As you can see, my firmware version is 1.7.6. We're going to upgrade this to the newest version. So, what we're going to do now is go over to my PC. Now what we need to do is to go onto the Avo Media website. So the Avo Media website is basically www.avomedia.com. Go to Game Capture. Scroll down. Go to AP and Driver. Then we scroll down. My version was this one here, 1.7.6. The new firmware is 2.0.6. Click on download. Click on save. I've already got a folder named Ava Media, so I'm going to save it in there. Like that. So while that's downloading, the important bit here is number two. Make sure to copy the two bin files to the root path of the USB flash drive. I will show you what that means in a moment. Right, what we need to do now is open the folder, right click. Now we have a folder that has the two files in. Do not copy this folder as it is. What you need to do is to copy the two files within that folder. Okay. What I'm going to do now, put the USB stick into the PC. Open. Just move that over slightly. Copy these two files and paste. Do not rename them anything. Just take those two out of there and put them in onto your USB stick. Right, that's done. I'm going to reject. Now we'll go back to the PS3 and the AV Media Capture device. Right, we're back. Now we're going to have to put the USB stick into the AV Media device, so make sure you switch the device off. As you see, the light is flashing. Right, the device is switching itself back on. I've put the USB stick in the device. There we go. So now we go to menu, go to settings, okay, go all the way down, go to product information. So I can just show you, as you can see, firmware version 1.7.6, come out of that, and then we go up to firmware upgrade. Click OK, and then we press F1 to upgrade. Because there's two files on there, both files will need to update onto the system. Right then, that was the first file that's updated onto the Avermedia device. Now the second one's going to update now. That was the first, now this is the second one. There you go, that's the second one that's updated. So now it says firmware version has been upgraded to 2.0.6. We're going to press OK. Now the device is going to restart itself. And then we will check the product information 
on the device. There we go. So now we will go to menu, go to settings, go all the way down to product information and there you have it, firmware version 2.0.6. Okay then guys, I hope this has helped in some way on how to update the firmware on the capture device.